How to prepare for inflation 2021? We are living in a money printing world with unpredictable government and indebted bank. People fear inflation. They are looking for a solution. They want to be, to be prepared when inflation arrives. Therefore, we have a specialist today with us, Mr. Mickey. He is a financier and an economic expert. He will tell us today seven ways how to be prepared for inflation 2021. Stay with us. Caputo and Partners, SwissBankingLawyers.com. We fight for your money. Hello, here is Enzo Caputo. I'm a Swiss banking lawyer, the founder of the boutique law firm Caputo and Partners and the blog SwissBankingLawyers.com, the place where successful business people find tips and solutions to better protect their assets and to pay less tax. Stay with us. We fight for your money. It's a great pleasure to have Jay Mickey today with us. He will tell us the seven ways how to be prepared against inflation 2021. Mickey, so what we have to do to be prepared for these events, for, uh, for inflation? Well, I'm sure there's lots of ways, Enzo, and thank you for the invitation today. It's always nice it's a to pleasure. be in Zurich, it's always a pleasure. nice to be with you. It's a great you. pleasure. But um, I, when I thought about this, this topic, of course, is near and dear to my heart, and I, I look back at history, and what have been the great stores of value? In particular, I can't say, I can't see anything better than, than precious metals. I know they've had some ups and some downs, but overall against fiat currency and most asset classes, they retain value. So for thousands of years, huh? thousands you of can years. go back in history for thousands, thousands of they years. retain value. And, and yeah. they're well respected and well regarded today. Uh, one thing we want to do is we want to be out of US dollars. US dollars are not the place to be. The government is out of control with debt, printing a lot of money, and there's a lot of money being put into circulation, which is causing extensive amounts of inflation. Now, I, agree. I, I want to say to the listeners that that inflation will be somewhat transitory. You hear this term transitory inflation, but the reality is, is this, these inflation, the stimulus will cause prices to rise. They will flatten out but they won't come back down. Don't trust were. the US dollar. Don't <laughs> trust the US dollar. Look for diversification, look for currency diversification. A good idea to diversify obviously is the Swiss franc. A Swiss franc is very good, except there's one thing I don't like about the Swiss franc and that is that they have a little too much US exposure to equities uh, in their national bank, but they are trimming that. So that's a good sign right now. Thank you. Another Thank you, thing, Jay. another thing too is good gold and silver producers. If you look at their relative value next to their peers, they are they have a low valuation, yet they're some of the most positive cash flow companies out there. These are excellent, excellent hedges in an inflationary environment. The next thing we want to look very at interesting, very interesting. is junior miners. They are extremely undervalued. And when we have a, another move in inflation, and the constant erosion against the dollar and other and other uh, assets that people use to live on, that's when we're going to see a substantial rise in those in those various stocks. The other thing on my list is industrial and battery metals. That's a that's a burgeoning industry. It's a commodity. Anything to do with copper. This is going to be a terrific growth opportunity for people, and you'll be able to hedge a lot of the inflation. Don't. Don't sit still and let your currency, your fiat currency, lose value. Every day it's losing value, and it has for hundreds of years. Yeah. Don't let it happen. Take these measures. So you have to invest in tangible assets, or physical gold, or silver, or shares, mining stocks. Mining stocks are really low. And diversification in currencies. Don't be focused on the US dollar because the US dollar is a dangerous currency. So that's why you have to be diversified. Thank you very much, Mickey, for, for all these nice ideas. 
information just like this you cannot find in universities or in bibliotheques or in libraries. If you want more information just like this, just subscribe to my YouTube channel and ring the bell. By doing so, you will never miss a new video. Be rich and stay rich. I wish you a beautiful day.